Hi, welcome to this third episode of Unity Game Development for Complete Beginner series. In the previous episode, we did a quick tour of the Unity editor. We looked at various windows and tools in the editor such as the project window, the scene view, the game view, play mode, the hierarchy window, the inspector window, the toolbar, and the layout tool in the Unity. If you haven't watched our previous tutorial, then please watch it first and then come back. In this episode, we will have a quick look of gameplay in 2D. While famous for its 3D capabilities, Unity can also be used to create 2D games. You can choose to open your editor in 2D mode window directly from Unity Hub or you can switch between 2D and 3D modes in scene view. This is the most immediately noticeable feature and toolbar for the scene view. 2D graphics. Graphic objects in 2D are known as sprites. Sprite use 2D images placed in assets folder. We can either drag and drop a 2D image for sprites from outside of Unity or we can make our own sprite image. For that purpose, right click on the editor window, go to create sprites and choose a sprite for your desired shape. Name this image and make sure that the inspector window the texture type is selected as sprite, 2D and UI. Either the sprite image is dragged and dropped from outside of Unity or it's made in the project window. It's a good practice to keep everything in separate folders so for our sprites we will make a folder named sprites and move our sprites into the sprites folder. Now in order to view our sprites in the scene window, right click on the hierarchy to the objects sprite. You can rename this sprite either by right clicking it and selecting rename and you can rename it from the inspector window. Right now we cannot see anything on our screen because no image is assigned to our sprite. Sprites are rendered with a sprite renderer component. When you create a new sprite, this component is already attached to the sprite. If not, you can add it to your sprite anytime by clicking on the add component and sprite renderer component. Now you simply drag and drop your sprite image to the sprite component of sprite renderer while the sprite being selected in the hierarchy. Or you can click on this round circle, a new window pops up showing all the sprites in your project window. You can simply select your sprite image from there. You can change your sprite image anytime you want. There are some other properties in the sprite renderer component like flipping your sprite on the x and y axis and many others that we don't need to learn at this point. That was all for this episode. In the next episode, we will learn about sorting layers in Unity and how we can sort sprites in a layer or multiple layers.